If somebody said to me when I was eight years old, um, in the middle of summer, and they went, this is what we're gonna do with you today, Dal. We're gonna get you exercising for the next 10 hours. You're gonna wake up, have some breakfast, you're gonna go outside, and we're gonna get you to do some exercise until the sun comes down. I'd have been like, <laughs> that doesn't sound like fun to me at all. Nothing about that sounds appetizing. But if I woke up back then, and I said to myself, or well, my friends knocked the door and said, hey, do you wanna go out and play? <laughs> yes. <laughs> All day, yes. I would never have said, oh, you know what, I'm a bit too tired, my muscles are sore, you know, maybe tomorrow, maybe in a few days. No, I, I lived, I relished and lived for those days of all day long of my parents saying, get the heck outside, don't come back unless it's time for you to have something to eat, don't get into any trouble out there. <laughs> um, I would love to re-experience those days. In terms of my childhood, that's what I want to recreate as an adult those pleasures and those pleasures most of them came from movement they came from active play you know that's that's what I remember and so um, there's no reason why as adults we have to lose that we, we don't we can we can and it doesn't have to be just nostalgic we can recreate some of those in an adult <laughs> fashion and that's what kind of primal play is about